We'll guide you through how to fix your monitor randomly going black. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. First things first, go and check the physical connection between your monitor and your computer. So make sure the cables are properly plugged in. And if possible, you could try using a different cable as well in case one isn't working. After you've done that, then what you want to do is come to the bottom of your computer and click on search. And you want to type in change screen saver, just like so, it should pop up. And then what you want to do is where it says screensaver, make sure it's set to none. And once it's set to none, you'll need to click on apply and then go and click on at the bottom here, change power settings. This will take you straight here. Go to the right of the plan you have selected and go and click on change plan settings. And as you can see at the moment, after 15 minutes, my monitor will be turned off. This is when your PC isn't being used, but still you may not want it to be turning off. So set that to never as well, if you want it to be, and then click on save changes. For the next method, come to the bottom of your computer and click on search and type in device manager like this. And then you need to find display adapters and go and click on the arrow to expand it. Find the adapter you're using. In this case, I'm using an Nvidia graphics card, but yours may be different. Right click on it and click on update driver, click on search automatically, and it will then do an automatic search. But it does say here, there may be better drivers in Windows update or on the device manufacturer's website. So I actually have separate drivers for my NVIDIA graphics card. You may do too. So what you can do is go to your graphics card manufacturer's website and download them from there if you haven't got them at all. However, if you've already got them, which I do, I'll open it up now, then simply go and open up the driver application and then go and click on drivers and you go and make sure you've got the most recent update, which you can do by clicking on check for updates and I've got an update available, which I'll go and do now. So yeah, make sure your graphics card is up to date. 